G'day, bit of a tadpole update. Uh, we're draining the bed, getting them ready for a move. Um, they're going to holiday over there in those barrels for a little while. And then, um, yeah, they'll be moved back into the bed with some nice clean water over there. Um, I'm using this I'm using this opportunity too to cut down the rest of this bed. Now I know how I want it to go for the aquaponics setup and get that in place at the same time, nice and level and ready for the grow beds. So, just thought I'd show you step one. Next, I'll be going into there. Just while this is siphoning, just show you guys what these little fellas have done. They've stripped all the green from that lettuce leaf and just leaving the um, veins in the leaf. It's rather spectacular, really, what they can do. I've done the same with that one there. They're starting to swarm in the corner, wanting to know what's going on at the moment. The water's decreasing. Rightio, halfway there, I think. Um, I've lined up the um, base of the stand here. Tadpoles are all in that drum there. Some boiled lettuce in there with them. I'm using the emergency pump, a little pump from the barrel ponic system to pump that water up into here. So, I'll start introducing the um, tadpoles when it gets about half full, I think. So, see how we go. Just there is a um, flame tail gudgeon. He's just in underneath the lettuce there. There we go, sort of making that a little bit better there. So he's under there hiding away. There's two of them. I can't find the other one. But they're in there because they'll eat mozzie larvae, but they won't affect the um, tadpoles. So there's a whole heap of them, as you can see. I've put the shade cloth up. Um, zoom out. I've put the shade cloth up mainly for um, predators. So we get a lot of um, kookaburras and kingfishers and the like around here. So better safe than sorry. Um, and the pigeons will probably come down for a bath in here as well if they could. So I'm just going to put this um, shade sail up. Just tie this last section over. So there we go. That's pretty much all it. Um, let's see if I can get a better shot of Mr. Gudgeon there. I'll just zoom in. There we go. You can sort of make him out. Way too far. So... Oh, did you see that? He just grabbed a mozzie larvae. Well, I'll be. Anyway, pretty happy about that. So that's it. The tadpoles have migrated. Um, we're just going to keep feeding him from now on. I've got to put some um, furniture or ornaments in there. Not for them to play on but so they've got somewhere to come out of the water when they get their legs so so that's pretty much we'll let on the tadpole update have a good one